It was a uh, mixed farm. But both my my mum's side of the family all farm in, in West Devon in Holsworthy, and uh, my side of the family in North Cornwall in Kilcampton, just north of Bude. And we had dairy and kept some sheep and you know brought through our, our, our stock and, and, and some beef and a little bit of cereal. So we had a kind of a a mixed bag of everything and uh, jack of all trades, master of none. <laughs> you know, you, you, you grow up as a, as a farmer's son that you, you know, when you're old enough to, to carry something, you're carrying it. When you're strong enough to be able to do something, you do it. You're, you're, you're filling gaps and closing gates and, uh, you know, very much hands on. When I left home, uh, you know, I was a herdsman. I used to do, do a lot of the milking and, uh, I can just, my visions and my memories of rugby at home were myself and my brother throwing the ball around in the, in the sheds and in the empty cattle sheds in the summer and I can, my brother used to play hooker and I can remember him just keep throwing the ball at the post and, and uh, you know, it just kind of happened like that. Um, all my family back home was still in farming, yeah, uh, mum's side of the family and, and, and dad's dad runs a, a farm shop from, the, from my home farm and brother runs um, beef and sheep and bits and pieces and try and put as much uh, produce through the, through the shop as possible and uh, yeah he's done fantastically well. You know the dream would be you know it would be fantastic the, the reality of, of now trying to, to set up a farming enterprise from scratch is unless you're a, a, a multi-millionaire would be you know was very very difficult but you know I'm still involved I still still look st still buy my magazines still look see what's going on and you know it's something that maybe in retirement now I look to develop and you know because I'm passionate about the countryside um, I'm passionate about my country and I hope that the, there'll be opportunities for me to hopefully uh, work with some some people to try and promote that whether that be produce the country the whatever it may be farming or non-farming then I hope I can be uh, of help and, and you know because it's something which I'm passionate about